let's see about your current situation or situations um whatever that is that you are dealing with at, at this time let's see what you need to know what you should do what the future um will bring for you so i will use first these cards here and then i have some more prepared for you so if the first messages are not resonating with your life your situation um just wait because there is more to come i will not focus only on one specific situation but let's see what it's all about in um this first uh, round let's call it that way let's see taurus um about a situation that you are dealing with right now what you should know okay you need to remember something that being kind being helpful um it's a hard job <laughs> it's a it's not easy right it's not that easy but it's so fulfilling and um you need to reconsider here maybe someone asked you for something ask your help your advice your something and maybe you rejected that person reconsider all right and also there is you know you may have rejected someone because you have a lot going on um your advice from the card is also about you know taking it step by step uh, maybe you know because you you are dealing with too many things in the same time you are overwhelmed and you are like i don't have time to help you i don't have time to help nobody else because i have already so much to do for myself right so even though it's so crazy you need to you know take things step by step and in between there try to help someone okay very interesting now let's see so there is a change in your um in the way you do some things or the way your life is going right now okay there are some needed changes um so one one of the changes is like taking it step by step okay you cannot do all in the same time so better um you know make a problem in small problems than to try to solve it at once um let me grab one more card for you here and uh, let's see the outcome of this changing or changes sorry mm -hmm. so what i get for you here is you will be surprised taurus of how well things how good things will start going for you you will see great improvements you will also um, realize that there is more help around you than you thought it is all right so um you have the jupiter card here which this card is like a big yes you know it's like um you are you are going to be lucky there is something good that will happen to you either you will find out uh, um you know that uh, actually um you you can manage life much better so the changes that you were advised in the beginning um are good because it will bring you some sort of uh freedom you will find out that you have more time than you thought um and also this will bring you into like either you'll meet someone there is like a new connection you will make new connections that will help you you will be blessed all right things will start going really in your in your favor uh, maybe now you don't feel that way but making some changes as we've seen in the beginning here 
you will see that you won't regret your life will change um will change for better okay now um before i i always put them wrong okay Taurus. Let's see what else. If the first message wasn't for you, let's see what else um, is happening with you right now, how you should deal with it. Uh, what is the advice uh, for you in this right moment? Patience. Okay. Patience. Again, there is a connection. And again, the patience card. Okay. There is here something for you. Have patience because you will meet the right person. The right person that will help you, that will change something in your life for better. I don't know what is with this, but there is something definitely. Let's see. Taurus. It's like you right now, maybe you lost your patience. Maybe you had enough of waiting, like things to go well, like things to get easier, or at least not to get easier, but to have some sort of help, some sort of understanding. And it looks like you will um, get to know someone that will help you. Now let's see current situation. Okay. All right. So um, let go. Stop thinking. Stop waiting for something that is not in your life anymore or it's like far away from you. So if you know that you are doing this, your advice here is to, to let go of that, okay? And and once you let go of it, you will see that um, there is um, um, there is new there is something new starting, something new will um, a new phase will start. It's like, let's say you have been in a relationship, right? And you are not with that person anymore. You kind of still holding on into them, even though you say you don't, but the fact that you talk all the time about them, the fact that you, um, you always talk like what they did to you, how they affect your life, all this uh, victim mentality. And it, it, it's everything shows that you are kind of still thinking of that person at that situation. So if this is you, now is the, the, the right time like you to let it go, to make space in your life for something new, okay? And don't be, uh, you need to be realistic. It's not like, okay, today I'm not talking about this person, where is the other one, right? It's not working that way. So have patience and stop running after things that are not realistic, all right? You need to be, um, to really be realistic this is this is the only word that uh it's coming popping in my mind so um yeah let's see let's see a little bit more about this all right you won't regret by waiting so um don't just jump into a new thing without healing yourself from something that happened into the past this is another thing that i get for you here so um uh, yeah, for some of you, there is a relationship here. There is something that um, is just kind of not, did not work out. It's not working out. Someone here stopped talking with you. Someone is very cold, very distant. Um, this is what you are holding on to right now. Wait a second. What is coming here? The full card. Is this? It's kind of, you are avoiding this, this new beginning. It's a little bit, um, you know, like 
yeah, you are not that sure. Should I take a leap of faith? Should I try something new? Should I right? It was weird how the card came out. Um, ask what you should do, Five of Cups in reverse. Uh, Five of Cups reverse is like move on, move on from that pain, move on from that disappointment. Uh, heal yourself and move on. You know, you need to find your peace. It's time to, um, to, to move on. Look at this. Move towards the future without carrying all that weight let it go let them go if they left if they don't talk with you then that says a lot why you should spend your energy thinking about them they don't do that for you taurus the empress in reverse so um in the future here as an advice for you is make sure that you don't repeat the same mistake make sure that you will be on your feet make sure that you will be um, independent make sure that um, you will um, rely on yourself and nobody's nobody else's uh, help or you know support in the future here you need to avoid doing the same old mistakes and you know um, it might be hard for you to to understand or to to see in the future right now but things will start going better for you, okay? Now, um, reevaluate where, in what, where you invest your time, your energy, your feelings. It's uh, very important because, um, and even in the future, you always have to reevaluate where you stand. Are you on the right path? It, does it feel right to help this person or that person? Uh, do you feel that you are in a situation where you give too much? Then stop, then see, um, you know, don't rush anything. Um, make sure that you, you, you make new steps, that you make things differently. Um, try to avoid doing the same old mistakes. So um, definitely here, in order like you to move on, in order like you to to have here a better yeah close the cycle i wanted to say you know like your life to to change for better to forget about what happened to you you need to um to do things differently okay so what you need to know that letting go of someone stop talking about them stop bringing them into your life um it's for the best something here has to come to an end as something new will start okay so you have the cycles card which is all about this let's see what else we have the commitment things are getting serious in the future here what you don't know is that once you let go of something that um you hold on right now hold you back um, once you make space in your life, then it will happen. The opportunities are coming. If there is a job, if there is a relationship, you will have a new opportunity here. Okay. Now, <sighs> be realistic about where you stand. What is the, the, the reality of your life in this right moment? okay and don't make it worse but don't make it better also so be be realistic is very important someone here is watching you from above and uh, also when you pray when you ask from the universe um make sure that you you say exactly what you want so don't say i want money say i want a job i wish to to do this and you will see that you will set up your mind and you start working towards that okay i want to have a better relationship than what i had before so what i bring to the table how should i be what kind of person 
I want to attract, right? Which, which, what kind of person I could have all of this and so on. So is this need of being clear, okay? Of being clear of what you want in the future for you, for your life, okay? So my dear Taurus, this is what I've got for you in this moment. I really hope you enjoyed this reading. And uh, please don't forget to like, share, subscribe, support my channel here. I really, really appreciate your help, your support. Thank you so much. Um, I wish you all the best. Take care of yourself. And I see you very soon um, with a new reading, of course.